Hey CK friends, it's Kay from ClosetQ6.com. I'm coming to you with a quick trendy thrift haul. Yes, I'm doing a haul. Um, I have not been thrifting lately, but I have plans on going soon. I just wanted to do a quick haul on some items that I already got to give you guys some ideas of things that you can get from thrift stores that are not just clothing. Clothing is a great place to get thrift clothing, I mean cl clothing items, but you can also get a good deal on um, accessory items especially shoes. Um, I have found so many different pairs of shoes for great prices. Um, I don't think I've bought any shoes over $20. Um, I almost want to say that I haven't bought any shoes over $10 at thrift stores, but a lot of times um, when I go thrifting at some of the uh, places I frequent, uh, when I find things such as boots or something like that, it might be like at $10 plus, you know, tax. Um, so today I want to do a quick haul on some of the shoes that I've gotten. These are pretty much um, summer spring type shoes, meaning toes are out and things like that because all my boots and things are packed away right now. But I have got some extraordinary deals on boots as well. Like I said, sometimes you'll find them for like $10. They're in really good shape. They're leather, real leather. They're in good condition. Um, I actually um, showed on a previous haul that Right as the season was changing, I got um, a pair of suede um, gray wedge boots for only a dollar. Great shape. So don't sleep on the thrift stores when it comes to buying shoes and other accessories. So let's get started. And the first pair of heels, um, shoes I'm going to show are actually heels. These are kind of a nudish or brownish tan color. And that was kind of why I was drawn with to them because they were um, neutral. Um, they have a cute heel on them. Oops, sorry, I dropped it. Whoa, it's in good shape. The heel is in good shape. It doesn't have like a whole bunch of scuff marks and wear and tear. Um, even the top on the heel, um, it was in really good shape. So I was like, I'm getting these. These shoes were not over like three dollars, right? Good shape. Like I said, a neutral color. I could wear with these with almost anything, especially when I'm kind of like, oh, I don't know what to wear with this outfit. Nude shoes are a great alternative to not being able to find something that matches. Now, this is not exactly the same color as my skin, of course, but it could still fall in the nude family of shoes. So sometimes you get kind of the more tannish color. Um, sometimes you'll get more of a chocolate brown, just depending on what your skin tone is and the shoes that fall into that category. So I got these for like $3 at a thrift store. And sometimes too, if they're having to sell, it's even better, like the boots I just talked about. Um, I got these purple suede heels. Like I said, just like the other pair, the heel was in really good shape. And that's something I always check for to see what condition this part is in. Because even though in past um, videos I've talked about, you could paint this and give it a different look or renew it. I'm not really crafty. I hate doing crafts sometimes. I'm just, sometimes I got to be in the mood for that. So um, I really look to see if this is intact. I always check the bottoms to see. It doesn't have a lot of wear and tear. Um, these were like almost newish. Like they've barely been worn. I always check the toes to make sure that there's not a lot of wear and tear here in the front. And of course the back to see if there's scuffing on the back and sides. So this shoe was in really good condition. I only got this for about $3 too. These particular shoes I got at the same place and unfortunately that place is closed down. Um, I haven't really worn the purple ones too many times yet though. But I really love the color. I was like, I don't really have too many pairs of purple, so let's get it. Okay, so the next pair, I've shown this in a past video. They're pewter colored heels. They got the sling back. Um, the heel is not as in great condition as the other two that I've shown. But because of the color of the shoe, like the pewter, it does have a little scuffing, but you can barely see it. I don't know if you guys could even see it in the video. Um, but the rest of the shoe is in really good condition and really great shape. And I thought these were just really cute. I love this. It's kind of like the nude color. Um, this color can go with almost anything. I could dress it up. I could dress it down, pair, throw on a pair of jeans or a jean skirt, and it'll be okay. Like, it's, it's kind of a go with anything color. So I had to get them. And I also love that the heel isn't too high. So it's perfect for wearing to work and walking around the office all day. So all these shoes, like I said before, that I'm showing today were all under $10 individually. Not all together, but individually. So I got great deals on all of them. The next pair are another pair of purple heels. But these are a little different. They're lower um, and the material is different. It also has like kind of a 
stone like pattern on it so I thought these would be better for like the office this is more like I'm going out the shoe I showed previously the suede one so they're a little different they're a little different color purple as well um, but I thought these would be better for the office and they're comfortable the toe is in it was in really good condition the heel as well as the toe and the rest of the material around the shoe um, these shoes were actually um, like five dollars and they're Jessica Simpson so I thought that was a good deal for that particular brand um, so I had to get them they're comfortable like I said they're perfect for wearing around the office and going throughout my day my work day okay so the next pair of shoes I got I did not out of all the shoes I have in my closet I didn't really have um, any red heels I had some red wedges um, that I barely ever wear and I don't know why but um, I didn't have any red heels so when I came across these I've always kind of when I'm thrifting looking for some that I like but when I came across these I was like oh I'm gonna get those they're a good deal they're cute um, and I could wear them with a lot of different things so I got these I think I showed these in this in a previous video as well they are open toe all the materials in really good condition it does have a little bit of scuffing but it was not very visible. This is the back. It's not a lot of scuffing or wear and tear here, which I thought was great, or in the heel. The bottom of the shoe was in decent condition. It was my size, it was perfect. I love the straps here. And I got these like on sale. I don't remember what the percentage off was, but I don't think I paid more than $4 for these. And like I said, they're in really good condition. And I think they're very versatile. The heel is not too high where I'm going to be uncomfortable, I can wear them to work, as well as like to church or out for the evening or whatever, and be comfortable and be fine. So I got these and they were really cute and they were, like I said, like around $4. Okay, so I have only a few more. Um, I got these American Eagle um, flat shoes. And I love these shoes. Like these have been my go-to for the summer. One, because of the color is brown kind of a lighter brown so it's very neutral it can go with so many different things kind of like the heels I showed first um, I love the straps even the big gaps in them it's kind of a low or ankle size gladiator almost to a degree with less straps I don't need too many straps but I thought it was cute I um, it's in really good condition it's leather um, and I thought it was cute it was a great deal I got these for like 688 I believe I bought three pairs of shoes that day so this was one of them and actually now that I'm thinking about it the pewter ones that I showed earlier these ones I got them the same time and they were the same price and I believe they both were 688 um, so correction on that other one but these were 688 plus tax of course and they're really cute they're comfortable they're perfect for the summer and they go with everything I have one more pair that I actually got when I bought those other two and these are these wedgies did I say that right because I always say wedges wedgies wedges my son always be like mom it's not a wedgie it's wedges so wedges and I love these I think these are perfect too like I said they're a neutral color uh, really kind of like a, I don't know off-white I don't know what the color would be on that but it goes with almost everything. The color is really perfect. These wedges were in perfect condition. Um, the heel was intact, especially with like the straw-like bottom. Sometimes you get it all, you know, kind of torn and ripped up. But this was in really good shape. The backs were in shape. They weren't dirty. It's very light and it wasn't like dirty or um, worn out. So I really had to get these. And these were $6.88 also. So I got all three pairs of those, $6.88 a piece. Um, so... I didn't pay over $10. Great deal. And I believe I got all three of those shoes from Goodwill. Okay, so these shoes I got a while ago. I haven't worn them a whole lot, but I didn't get from a thrift store. I got them from, I don't know the name of the store. All I know is they have orange bags. And I have seen the store like in different cities and stuff. So I got these on sale for $3. And I thought they were perfect for the um, summer as well they were brand new so I bought them brand new um, it has suede around the edges and it has a little accent there in the front so they were in good condition perfect three dollars I had to get them I thought they would be great for the summer um, I don't wear them a whole lot but 
it's nice to have that color and that option available. And then the last pair I'm going to show you are also wedges. They have kind of the suede look to them as well. Um, I get a lot of compliments on these, mainly because I think of the gold chain right here in the front. They're open toe, and they have like the straw-like bottom, similar to the other two shoes. Well, the last one was cork, but this one's straw-like, the neutral wedges. I really like the color on this. This is not as neutral as the other two, but I think it's still very versatile. Um, the only thing about these shoes is that because of the chain right here in the front, it makes a lot of noise when you walk. So it's kind of like you hear the jingle everywhere you go. But I got these shoes for free. So this I got from a swap, a free swap event, and they were free. So that was perfect. Like you can't pass that up. And it just happened that they were my size. So it worked out perfectly for me. So those are all the shoes I'm going to show today. I Like I said, I have a number of other shoes that I've gotten from thrift stores um, that were like under $20 or under $10. Um, these are kind of just some of the spring and summer ones that I've come across more recently. Um, so that is the haul. Keep in mind that you can always find a number of accessories at thrift stores, not just shoes. Purses are a great place to find thrift stores, even designer bags, um, necklaces, earrings, belts, scarves. It's a great place to shop for accessories. So don't bypass those sections when you are out thrifting. So take time to check me out on my website, www.closetkeepsakes.com. Become a friend, like us, subscribe, thumbs up. Um, check us out on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, LinkedIn, Lookbook, Blog Loving, WordPress. We're almost everywhere. Um, thanks for watching and keep thrifting. Have a good one. Bye.